Okay. Hello, my name is Hussein Ahmed. I am the writer, producer, director for The Last Hope that we just shot and completed in New Mexico, Alamogordo. Uh, I'm here to tell you about the storyline of the film, which is based on true events that takes place in northern Iraq. Um, it's, about a f it's about a family of a, mo a mother, father, and two kids who are walking back from the south to their village when they get chased by Saddam's men. Um, when that happened, the father panics and he takes his uh, kids and his wife on a horse and tells them to go, he'll meet them halfway so he can deal with these soldiers. But as he starts to fight back, he knows that he will lose his life if he doesn't get out of there since they're way more than him. So he takes off and he catches up with the family. Um, when he does, he realizes that they have gone too far. They have lost the soldiers behind them, but at the same time they have been lost themselves. And so the story begins and it's five days stranded and lost in the desert. Um, there's no food, no water. At the daytime it's about 150 degrees, it's too hot. At night it's below zero. Um, and especially kids will never survive more than two or three days. Uh, so it's, it's a struggle of, of a father who is trying to um, he was trying to save his family knowing it's near impossible uh, until he has to do a heroic sacrifice to save his family, which he does at the end um, by going away for a few seconds and being really angry at God and, and, and the whole thing, why is it happening to his family. Uh, then he has a little sign from God that he has to do something, do it very fast, and he does, which is he, he cuts off a chunk of meat from his uh, leg, from his thigh. He comes back to his family, he, he, he kind of forces them to eat, and he encourages them to move on. And when they do, after a mile or, or so, they see lights from far, which he did, you know, he did uh, find a solution for his family, but at, at the same time, he's losing a lot of blood. When his wife, uh, she realizes what's going on, she, she goes back to him and she realizes what he did for her and for the kids. So it's a beautiful, beautiful story um, that has to be told. And the, the, the audience, I think, will really embrace it. Because it, it, no matter who you are, as a father, as a mother, as a family, you will feel it. And uh, so I hope you enjoy it once it comes out. Uh, thank you so much.